Please welcome Robert Ellison. Good evening, everybody. For me, this is quite an emotional um, day. Well, Johnny and I nice to be here. Now, I'm going to start this one off. Do sit down. I'm going to start this one off, and of course, you're going to go on with it. I've, been, I've read these aphorisms twice. I've really enjoyed them. You know, great stuff. When you say original aphorisms, do you mean you thought them up? Quite right. This book, Wisdom and Wordplay, is just a taster. This is 100th part, 100th part of my, of my total sort of earth. <laughs> what is an aphorism? An, an aphorism is a pithy, short, usually one-liner, and possibly with a, with a touch of wisdom in it. Do you polish your aphorisms? You know, you all work the, all, all the time. All the time. All the time. I never stop. May Look I? at this. I'm going to open this at random. Oh, do, yes. And, and I'm going to read out <laughs> at random. What I'm going to do, I'm going to shut my eyes and put my finger on something. Cremation stops you taking your secrets to the grave. Yes, good. You see, this is, this is a man who's got real, real style. I had no idea that my private hobby would ever become public. Had it become public, I would have started publishing after two, three, four years. But I never published a word for 20 years, and it never occurred to me to do so. The thing that amazes me is um, the sheer body of work that you've created. If, if there's one thing that is more important than anything, I think it's a love of language and sharing that love of language yes. with other people. I think uh, you've achieved uh, all of those tonight, and I congratulate you, and uh, I welcome you to do the same. Ladies and gentlemen, Robert Anderson.